For every spider lost in this great big world, there is a warm place with friendly room service, delicious food, and a warm place to stay the night. This is Spider Bed and Breakfast. So, the other day as I left the lab where I work, I was going through the basement of the building and I saw a spider crossing the floor and I was like, hey, that thing's pretty big. I love spiders, so I decided to take a closer look. And you guys will be able to see in this footage that its butt was super shriveled up. It was not doing well, and that was probably the reason why I was walking slowly through a building. So I figured I could take it home and give it something to eat and a nice warm place to stay. And here's a cricket, and you can see it's, it really wanted the cricket. After looking up what it was, I found that it was a Drasides cuprius, or a common ground spider. And more particularly, it was a male. Being a lover of arachnids like I am, and knowing that spiders are not that hard to take care of, I decided to start this spider bed and breakfast kind of thing. If I see a lost spider anywhere instead of putting it outside or whatever, maybe just take care of it for a night. You get some really cool experiences learning lots about spiders in your area, and you can even get really cool feeding videos like this one I'm about to show you guys here. The video is a little blurry here, but then you'll see the teeth just sink into the, the cricket and the fight that it gives, and it was just really cool. It was cool to see a spider that was really suffering to find food in a weird time in Utah, and that we were able to give it something to eat. And yeah, that was what stemmed this idea, and so we're going to be doing this with other spiders as well. Just if you see them in need, just take them in and take care of them. So after helping the spiders get back on all eight of their feet again, you let them go. You can see this one, after being fed and spending the night with us, had a more full abdomen and just looked a lot healthier. And that's the goal of Spider Bed and Breakfast, is to help them out, learn about them, and get them back on their feet. So this was me letting the spider go, and this was so hard. Drasodes cuprius are burrowing spiders. Well, kind of. They um, burrow in the dirt when they go to sleep. And so I had to look for it before I let it go. Eventually I just gave up, got a leaf in there, and helped him onto the leaf, and let him out. But, like anybody would at such a fantastic place like Spider Bed and Breakfast, he wanted to come back. But, with a little persuasion, he was on his way. Hi, buddy. Bye. So yeah, Spider Bread and Breakfast is going to be a mini-series on this channel because it's only going to happen whenever we find a spider that's in need that we can bring in and take care of for a while. But yeah, leave us a like for this weird feeding video and this new idea and comment below what sort of spider we should be looking for next. Just a reminder, we do have a Facebook page, so check us out there. And if you haven't already, like and subscribe this video. And thanks for watching, you guys.